agricultural stakeholders in our states are ordering the government to con reconsider policies that may hinder the growth of farmers and agro processing sectors. The belief IDC calls down border reopenings have reduced competitiveness. Uh, stakeholders suggest technology driven initiatives to reduce dependence on electricity and diesel and uh, convert farm waste into bioenergy and promote information sharing among farmers. They also advocate for a shift away from gas and oil on Saturday primary revenue generating sector. Consume 150 litres of diesel per hour to operate. So that tells you how much energy is required to operate an industry in a rural location. And that's where solar PV has a limitation. It might be able to meet part of that load or even all of that load during the day. Well, if they're operating through the night, that's when you need a bioenergy solution so that we can convert what you see behind me in waste biomass into renewable electricity and renewable heat. That, uh, and the delivery of those to uh, the processing plants, which is where we are today at, uh, at the Atmancor uh, site facility, processing cassava field. So I, I think the challenges are to make all of these technologies and innovations interact with people to, bring, uh, to make that uh, uh, circular economy work effectively. Now, looking at how we can use um, some different products, but we'd love if government could come out with some, some initiatives to assist the processors. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.